a wreck! Fraser Island. I've never actually been here before, so I have my own personal tour guide. Where are we going? Apparently I've been here a couple of times before. <laughs> we're gonna go to Lake Mackenzie's, we've come off the Kingfisher Bay Ferry, and we're gonna leave on the Inskip Ferry. So we get to do like a nice little pass through. So we'll hit Mackenzie's first. I'm gonna uh, go for a nice swim. Yep. It's not gonna rain today, I promise. We'll, we'll see about that. So I have terrible experience with sand. Uh, if you watched the video I did the other day, you'll realize that. So I've got a better deflator. Makes no sense because you're a beach babe. You're always on the beach, but you never take your car on the beach. I hate sand. This is the biggest sand island in the world. So you're about to learn. <laughs> All right, so Sammy's going to teach me how to actually drive on sand. So what are we putting the tires to, 15? Yeah, I reckon. All right, I've got the goods and I've got $3.50 per litre of fuel. <laughs> So we're going to Lake Mackenzie. Let's go. All right, we're on our way down to Lake Mackenzie. We've got chairs and towel. All the stuff. And You're Sam's complaining about the walk already. All right, I'm allergic to exercise. <laughs> <laughs> it's a it's a medical condition. It's not a medical. It condition. is. It's not. I'm telling you. Whoa! Oh Whoa. my! That was a good reaction for TV. Let's put some dancing music to it. <laughs> or not. not Alright, finally the sun has come out. Oh, it has. I didn't realise. To wear one of your bikinis. Alright, maybe next video you can wear a bikini. Next video? <laughs> this video gets one likes. Oh. <laughs> I'll put a bikini on. <laughs> no likes later. <laughs> From Rosa. Alright, so fun fact, not so fun fact for me. I actually have this thing called cold urticaria. So it's an autoimmune disease, which pretty much means I'm allergic to the cold, which absolutely sucks when I'm swimming in like fresh water like this. So what happens is I pretty much cover in like welts and rashes, and if it's really bad, I'll just pass out. So it's happened a couple times in Cairns when I've gone down waterfalls, and then I'll just like pass out halfway down. So this you like those goats that you just clap now. <laughs> so this water is not too bad, but. I actually do have to be a bit careful when I go into really cold water, which is so bloody annoying, but that's okay. We make it work. Oh, if anyone else has that, can you comment below and let me know? Because I would love to know if there's something that I can do to try and minimize that actually happening. But um, yeah, a bit of an odd one. I was filming for you. You like, almost ran it over. A little leaf just knocked it out of my hand. <laughs> so, just pulled up at your own beach. It was actually meant to rain today, but it's now gotten stinking hot. So, I've just put the awning up, and yeah, we're just going to chill under there for a little bit. So I've just pulled up at Eli Creek. I've pretty much got my own personal videographer. So Sam's the one that actually told me to start my channel. So I'm just putting up with him Is for a couple me? days. I'm on smoke break. I've done enough filming for the day. <laughs> How good. But it's nice here, eh? Yeah, normally it flows, but it's changed direction and it's super shallow. So you can take some floaties up the top and then go the whole way down out to the ocean. Guys, so this is the Mahino Wreck. 
In 1965, the ship was out there and it broke down. So what they did, they got another ship with a tow strap and the tow strap snapped and then it drifted here and got bogged. And the people have tried to recover it ever since with their winch on their forward row. Fuck, I went on Steve Irwin on that one, didn't I? <laughs> I did. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? That's not where they belong. <laughs> So I've just put up at Champagne Pools. It's ridiculously windy, but we're gonna camp somewhere across the other side of there. Don't mind me, just hiding from the sun. So um, yeah, we've just pulled up at a campground. We've gone a little bit higher because the tide's on its way in. But um, yeah, that sun is still scorching. So I do really want to get in the water and go for a swim. So I'm just going to set up camp and then relax for the rest of the other. Good morning, just done the pack up. It is so bloody hot already. So we're just gonna head across to Rainbow Beach today. We're gonna go to Double Island, but the tide's on its way up. So yeah, we're just gonna cruise on down there and I'll show you guys what we get up to. lost this little shit then. I was flying it and then it just goes battery low landing and it was freaking all the way back here. Little shit. So the tide is on its way up. It's meant to come up in another half an hour. I'm still got a little bit to go until we get to the furthest point of the island down south. So we're hoping there's a turn off up here that will take us inland. It also looks like it's about to piss down as well, so we might get stuck in a bit of that too. So pretty much what happened then was the caravan got pretty stuck. So Sammy boy saved the day because I don't have any recovery points on the back of my car. So obviously couldn't use mine. He gave me a hundred bucks, what a legend. I didn't want it, I was like, nah, I don't need it. He's like, that's the right thing to do. He's like, I would have lost my $10,000 caravan. I was like, wow. It was fair. actually getting pretty close to the water. Yeah, the water was like hitting the wheels, it was pretty bad. And then just past that, there was a point that we could duck off in the middle. So it worked out pretty good anyway. But we are back on the other side of the island. So we're gonna wrap up the video here. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Subscribe and check out Marossa 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 Swimwear. Oh yeah, these are my faders, Marossa Swimwear. And this is built not bought with his bloody Yeah, get, get a bucket out. Guys, good with the swimwear. <laughs> Double whammy. All right, thanks for watching guys. <laughs>